it's hard for people to understand that it's not about woke this, woke that. These are suicidal individuals who are trying to make the rest of us commit suicide along with them. And let me remind all of you out there who are listening, Rome did not pass away. I'm a student of history. Rome was assassinated from within and by the invasion of the barbarians. Those two elements are occurring in America today. What's up, everybody? Major Retired Richard Ojeda here. And Michael Savage, host of Savage Nation, claimed that the only reason young people would join the military these days would be for the sex change operations that the military provides. Really? Looking like he just slid off the set of a cheap detective sitcom, Savage declared that he had had enough. And for Memorial Day, I've studied what they have done to the military. We all know, Carl, this will strike a chord with you. We all know the recruitment mm. goals are in the toilet. Why would a young man enlist in the military other than to prove himself? January 2021, the terrorist Biden signs an executive order that opens military service to all transgender individuals. We hear that that's a good thing because all the transgenders, as you well know, are the best warriors on the battlefield. And then it gets worse. Biden decrees that active members of the military can take time off from their duties to get free sex change surgeries, Carl, and all related Ugh. expensive hormones, Carl, and all expensive drugs, Carl, at our expense. That's what they went in the military for, for free sex change surgery. Savage, who was born Michael Weiner, claimed to be a student of history and that America was going to fall like Rome did. He went off on a misguided rant, blaming the ACLU for the ills of society, and even went so far as to say it's the ACLU that should be tried for sedition and deported. Carl Higby looked on as his mangy guests lied about service members on Memorial Day. The Jackaloon said that Biden has authorized active duty service members to get free sex change surgeries and said that the surgeries was what was convincing anyone to serve, which is absolute garbage. If we don't stop mm -hmm. these psychopathic haters, they will snap the crosses off the graves of our war memorials. How far away well, are we from someone saying, all those crosses make me uncomfortable and I want them snapped off the graves of dead soldiers? Who's going to stop them, Carl? Me. I'll, I'll stop them, Mike. And I'll that's, stop the, that's them. the issue. You got a you bunch know, of people just like me. Carl, yeah. I've had enough. But, I've had enough. I'm an old man, but I'll tell you something. I'm willing to pick up bombs. I can't take it anymore. I can't take this anymore. The Army's policy on the matter states no person solely on the basis of his or her gender identity will be, number one, involuntary separated or discharged from the military services, number two, denied re-enlistment or continuation of services in the military services, or number three, subjected to at her adverse action or mistreatment. TRICARE, which is a military health insurance provider, may cover intersex surgery to correct ambiguous genitalia only when it is documented as being present for birth all these people they do this stuff in schools they're oh we're going to trans your kids without your son what just just hear me out michael what happens if i just started go or, or we started going around as conservatives started baptizing people in in elementary school without parental consent the liberals would lose their mind why not do it there's no sex changes going on. These two jackaloons are openly engaging in transphobic rhetoric aimed at the gullible audience. They are cruel and despicable excuses for human beings. Why is it that the far-right morons are so preoccupied with sex? It seems like every other day some GOP crackpot is being busted for child porn or crimes against children. But jackaloons like Carl Higby and Michael the Wiener Savage aren't interested in presenting the truth. They are interested in ratings and they don't care who they step on. They are pathetic, and that's an absolute fact. Sappers clear the way, airborne all the way.